Virtual Fighter 5 Revel is now going to be a thing. That is hopefully not the Virtual Fighter that they've been working on all this time. I swear to God, this better not be the Virtual Fighter you were leaking, Midori. But if it is, I'm not going to be like super, super upset about it because I'm going to get, not just I, we, <laughs> it's just about me, y'all. Okay, we are going to get a new version of Virtual Fighter 5 in the Revo, I'm just calling it Revolution. You just, just call it Revolution. It's called Virtual Fighter 5 Revo. Now, what's going to be in it? We're going to have multiple things that are important. The most important thing is rollback. We're getting rollback, y'all. <laughs> They're finally giving us rollback! It's time! That's why I'm dressed so beautifully in my festive outfit. This is for the rollback! It's not just for that though, it's also for balance changes. We're getting balance updates. Now I care about that, but what you probably care about, because you don't give a damn about balance, is it's on PC. It's on Steam! It's on PC and it's on Steam! You've gotten what you wanted! This is what you wanted, isn't it? Now let's take a look at that opener. Do you feel chat? It's a new song for new vocals to what sounds to me like the old credits theme for the original final showdown. I don't think Elton John even had a special. Oh, that looks cool. Now, to be fair, this is not new. This is not new. This was here before. But you, you know, it's amazing what having this man's voice, the voice of Sega, singing. Daytona USA, that's who's singing this song. He's here giving us his beautiful voice. And this is so hype. It's so hype. Oh, God, Vanessa Lewis is so fucking fine. There's Go. A lot of Tekken hits like Go. Oh, fuck. They might make Go strong. No! I don't want to deal with more of that. Look at that girl. She got a, she got a, she got a badass stopping inch. They, they stopped the music for her. They were like, you know what? I lean so badass. We're going to buff her so much. We're going to pause to make you feel the gravity of her entry. <laughs> Virtual Fighter 5 Revo. R-E-V-O. Which means it stands for something. So, so, so here's what I'm really excited about. Well, first, for, first, 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 first. What do y'all care about? Okay. Crossplay. And if you already have the Virtual Fighter Ultimate Showdown version that is on the um, PS4, also PS5, backward compatible. So don't. I want to hear my oh. I don't have a PS5. I don't have a PS4. You can play it on both. Okay, so I can play it. Jeez. Um, please. 
um, it is going to also get version 2 on the PS4. So it's going to be a new version for everyone. Uh, but the console version, we don't know whether they're going to be able to play with our PC master... Oh, 4K 60 frames per second, by the way. Yeah, our PC players are going to be on 4K 60 frames a second. That was not on the, uh, what was it called? The PS4? Yeah, that wasn't a thing on the PS4. It was still 1080p. It looked pretty. And the I think PS5 had like upscaling or something. And they're pretty too. But you know what's also happening? It's coming out this winter. Winter's now. It is, it is winter now. They could drop this next week. You know how Sega be doing? You know how Sega is? Okay? You don't know what they're gonna do. You don't know what they're gonna do. Now, now here's what I like about this. Okay? 4K, I don't really care about that. 60 frames per second? Of course it's gonna be 60 frames per second. Like, that's... Come on, y'all. Like, we're hungry. We ain't, we ain't that hungry. Like... Got some standards here. God damn. It being on Steam's huge. Absolutely huge. It's like one of the best things I could have done. I wasn't even expecting it to come. Rollback is now another bare minimum, which they're finally, finally respecting. They're saying, you know, okay, fine. We get it. Outside Japan, this net code ass. And by the way, if you were in Africa, you were screwed because you couldn't play it online at all. It just didn't work. So like a whole continent was like, nah, nah, you don't get to play this game. Okay, that's that's how Sega's treated this game in the past. Has treated its fans and limited itself. Has really kind of cut itself at the ankles in the past by how it's treated this franchise. And in Japan, it's done phenomenally. It has a whole circuit of players, some of them are new, that are godlike. You know why they're godlike? Because they get to play against really strong players in really good online connections. Because ain't nobody going to the arcade to play there either. Okay? It's all at the people's houses, you're playing online, and the online's good. Like, it's actually good in Japan. Only in Japan. The rest of us has to suffer. Now, now I don't know when this is coming out. So I don't know if anything I'm going to say might have any potential influence on these balance changes that might be coming, that we know are coming, not might be, we know they're coming. I have been begging, I have been begging for balance changes. Like, I have been begging for it. Like, you please, in the next version, like, fix this shit. Here's what you gotta fix, okay? Here's the biggest problem with Virtual Fighter 5 Ultimate Showdown. I know y'all, people who don't play this game that much or have heard about it, you think Virtual Fighter, Virtual Fighter is the most balanced thing in the world. It, it, it is more balanced than most other games, okay? It is. All right, fine. Doesn't mean we're perfect. Doesn't mean we don't have room for improvement. Okay? So here are the notes for the next balance update and hopefully we'll have multiple updates throughout the year we might have two more years of this two more years of having to downplay our mains i get to down i get to downplay my main all over again i had to upplay my main because eileen is horrible okay she's absolute garbage all right all right, I don't have to lie about it anymore. I can, I can be honest. I can finally be honest about this. Okay. She is so bad. Like, like, I'm going to tell you why. And it's not just her. It's all the light characters in the game. All the characters that are like middleweight to like super lightweight are bad. And the lighter they get, the worse they get. And the reason why they're so bad is because when you're light in Virtual Fighter, you take more damage. Why do you take more damage? Because when you are floated in the air, you float higher and you fall slower and you suck yourself to the wall from farther away. Okay? 
And the world's always there! The world's always there! <laughs> Order of Hangouts are gonna be there. So you get, you get wrung out more easily. You get comboed into the wall more easily. And what do you get for it? Some of us get a one frame faster jab, which is a big deal. I'm not gonna say it's not a big deal. That's a big deal. But it's not worth that, okay? It's not. The problem is they're too unsafe. The lighter characters in Virtual Fighter 5 Ultimate Showdown are too light and they take too much damage and they're too unsafe around the tools that they have to use to play the game. So either make them not so heavy, I mean not so light, or give them the thing that a lightweight character is supposed to have, which is safety! Okay? The, the, the whole, the whole gambit of playing a light character is to say, all right, all right, fine. If you manage to hit me, I'm gonna die. But I have control over when you get to hit me. If I'm good, I get to control that. The problem is the way the game is developed and designed right now, um, Eileen, for instance, has to become very risky. Like, I don't get control over my mix-ups. I don't get control over anything. I have to just throw the dice. Even if there's, like, even if I don't get much reward from the move. That, that's why it's jacked up. So, like, everything she does is super unsafe. It's super risky. And she's constantly putting herself in bad situations on block. When you have Akira over here sitting on... Akira's one of the heaviest characters in the game without being, like, a super heavyweight. Like, he, he's really heavy. So is Jackie. So is Brad. So is Go. You know what those characters have in common? They're all really good. They're really strong in this game. So, they... Taka's also really strong. So they gotta... They gotta make an adjustment to either the... And this isn't like a huge change they gotta make. All you gotta do is change the moves on block and on hit. But specifically on block. Negative five is a very important number for virtual fighter. Very, very important number. Once a move is more than negative five, think of it like, like in Tekken when you're negative seven, I mean negative nine, and you can't like step anymore, you have to just hold that. That number in virtual fighter is five. After negative five, get to just hold that. So uh, it's negative six, that's a huge, that's a huge deal. Eileen is at negative six all the time. But, there are these heavier characters that are at negative five on a regular basis. And the move, if it hits you, it's gonna lead to a full combo. What were they thinking? Why did they think that was a good idea? Please, RGG Studios, don't let that be a thing. Don't, don't, don't let these heavy weight characters just throw their weight around against us lighter characters. And have to eat it okay it's not fun i don't like it don't do it to me anymore i don't want to deal with that anymore please <sighs> you know how good it feels to say that and to know that they're actually listening <laughs> you know how good that feels we don't really have a lot of information we really don't have a lot of information all we can do is really, really predict they we can look at the steam chart. Let's look at the steam. Let's look at the steam thing. Look at, it. look at it. Look at this. Look at this beautiful art. Look at this beautiful, beautiful art. Oh my god. Look at that knee. Look at that knee. I mean, granted, is it very different? I don't think so. Virtual Fighter 5 Revo. Will your kung fu be enough? The Legendary Fighting Series makes its Steam debut with Virtual Fighter 5 Revo. Challenge the greatest fighters in the world in the ultimate remaster of the classic 3D fighter. Now featuring rollback, neckcoat support, gorgeous 4K graphics, and all the bone-crunching martial arts combat of the renowned original. Back
rattle through classic VF modes like arcade or ranked match. Create your own custom online tournaments and leagues with up to 16 players or learn from the best in spectator mode. Master your fighting style to defeat all challengers in the fifth world fighting tournament and become a virtual fighter legend! Features. The ultimate edition of this legendary game. Roll back that cult support. Gorgeous 4K visuals with updated high res textures and more. Ooh, more? What's more? <laughs> Custom combatants. Enter the ring with one of 19 playable characters. Master each of their unique fighting styles and customize them with distinctive costumes and items. Are we gonna get the items from the arcade version? Sega? Sega? Are we gonna arcade version? Give me the final total costumes! Give me the final total I want the. Give me costumes, yes! Give me costumes, SD! Give me the bathing suits! Give us the bathing suits! Okay? Give us the bathing suits back! Fuck! I want magical girl Eileen back with the long Hatsumik Miku hair. Give it to me. I need it. The full experience. Enjoy the pinnacle of Virtua Fighter as you battle it out across your favorite modes like rank match, arcade, training, and versus. No quest mode. No quest mode. Cross the competition! Take on challengers from around the world as you compete with up to 16 players in new online modes, including tournament and league. Wait, new modes? <laughs> what new modes? What new modes? What new modes? Mature content description. The developers describe this content like, this game may contain content not appropriate for all ages or may not be appropriate for viewing at work. Some nudity or sexual content, general mature content. Core values, this is not. 64 me pro bit processor is the, what they're telling us to get. They, they don't, they don't know. They don't know. Did it, <laughs> they don't know. Torrent already exists. Torrent mode already exists. So that's not a new mode. That, 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 that's not new. There's going to be in-game purchases. In-game chat. In-game chat! I mean, yeah, we, after we had in-game chat already. But it was like emojis and like, good games. Uh, what else we have here? Languages, full audio, English, Steam support, single player. Uh, it is release date. We don't know yet. Rollback is a big enough change for many players to decide to buy a game. Even if they bought it already, the fact that Rollback has now been introduced, it, it, it effectively becomes a brand new game for most players because now we can play people from farther away. Holy moly, I hope to God I can play players in Japan. If I can play players in Japan, and Korea, and Europe, I mean, I can only do that now. But if I could do that and not have Japanese players kick me from the lobby because they're like, holy moly, her connection is booty butt cheeks because she's in America. Okay, if I can have that, then it's a new game because suddenly I can play with new players now. You know, so I have a whole new player race to play with. It becomes bigger. The problem with delay based netcode for us outside Japan, I get to play the same like six people. Okay? I have like six folks in the country that I have a good connection with that would want to play me. <laughs> you know, that I'd want to also train with is like on a regular basis too. Like, like that want to play and like train and we're close enough and level that like they don't feel discouraged from me bodying them, you know? Like the other players who are really good, we're all spread out. Like Gentleman Thieves in Florida. It's in Hell State. Okay. Um Adam Yuki is in California. In like LA, where it has notoriously crap routing with the rest of the country. So they have the worst connections to everybody. Next to like I don't know, Austin, Texas or something? 
I think Texas has a really bad connection with a lot of places too. So like, it's it's really unfortunate. Um, I have better connections with Europe with French players. Makala Sushi, he's a uh, prominent virtual fighter player, Vanessa player in France, whom I didn't realize was in France for the longest time because I had a better connection with that motherfucker than people I had on the West Coast. I'm on the East Coast in New York. And on PC, yes, yes, project. So on PC, we might be able to maybe, you know, run it past 60 frames a second. Utilize that high frame rate, unlocked frame rate, lower latency, beneficial experiences that other games get to have, like Street Fighter. Oh my god, imagine. Oh my god, I'm getting excited already thinking about it. The blocks I'll be able to make. The low blocks. Oh, I'm going to be unhittable. Oh, I can't wait. Oh, I fucking can't wait. I can't wait. It's going to be so awesome. Oh, it's going to be so fucking awesome. I, can't, I just can't believe it. So, I got off track. They're testing the waters to see whether they can make a new game. I hope they are simultaneously developing the next game. And I hope what's happening right now is that they're they're designing the other features of EF6, like you know, quest mode, story mode, cinematics, whatever, those kind of things, stages, like those nuts and bolts. And that this version is where they're testing out balance changes that they want to introduce. Mechanics, I hope, I hope. Please bring us a new, give us some mechanic. Give us something to play with. Let us move around when we're back turner. Give us some mechanic to work with. Like, I, I, I will say, I'll be disappointed if there's no mechanical changes to the game at all. Like, like show us something. Make it feel like a new game. Because this is going to probably be around for the next two years, which is fine. I kind of wanted to have about two more years to really dig into Tekken. It's going to take me like a year to get like halfway decent at the game. It's only almost been a year now. I guess I am halfway decent, but like halfway decent to my own standard, which is not like y'all standards. Like I'm, my standards are maybe different. Okay. Um, I, 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 I halfway decent to me means like I'm a threat in a tournament bracket. That's what halfway decent means to me. Not what rank I am or, you know, that, that's not how I measure success or a skill. I measure the skill by my performance in the, in the bracket and whom I'm able to be threatening to in a bracket. So that will take me a little while. Maybe another another year. I feel like another year I'll be there. Um, I have to pay some going at the moment. But we'll see. Things might change. I might, I might have, you know, leaps here and there. But uh, yeah, having two more years. You heard that Japan was up... I heard that Japan was upset about Virtual Fighter 5 Final Showdown being too easy. You mean, what do you mean being too easy? You mean being too simple? Like dumbed down? Some people would not be happy about BF6. Yeah, of course. Of course not. Yeah, you know, a lot of players didn't like Virtual Fighter 5 uh, Final Showdown because of the uh, easy throw escape. They made throw escaping. You, so, so you no longer were allowed to multiple throw escape anymore, which was a hallmark component of all virtual fires that had it previously, which is four. Actually, it's actually just, just four, because that wasn't a thing in three. Uh, so four introduced multiple throw escape, and five vanilla had it as well. And so did 5R, but Final Showdown got rid of it. And you had to just guess between one of three directions. Uh, in the past, you could break up to four directions on reaction. I mean, not reaction, by prediction. Thanks for follow. Uh, and because of that, some characters only had five directions. Eileen only had four throws. So if you were good, you could break all of her throws. You were unthrowable. 
So I never really liked that mechanic personally because my character, if you were good, you would break maybe three throw directions. So I had one out of four, I had a 25% chance if I were to be completely random that I'd throw you. And note, only like two of her throws were good. The other two were just there to mix you up. So I got really good at throwing people. I, I, I would throw and I got really good at reading people's throws. So <laughs> when folks had to adjust to, you know, breaking throws or, or like actually getting like, like getting their throws broken, I already had the ability to, to mix my throws up efficiently so that I could deal with a 25% success rate. Now everyone's dealing with a, um, you know, two-thirds success rate, random chance, right? Which is still much better than what I was dealing with. Uh, that's why I got really good at throwing and predicting people's throws. But, yeah, I, uh, I think modern VF5 Final Showdown is much more positively received. It took time. It took time. You know, people, the things that were deep about the game previously were no longer there, but it introduced new mechanics and new implications that were just as difficult and just as diff impressive and hard. It just changed. Uh, virtual Fighter will always be Virtual Fighter because mechanics, its core roots, are the same. Its essence is the same. Its complexity distilled into the beauty of three magical buttons. It's OS, the fucking game. PB and J. Yeah. Precisely. So, like, do we get multiple versions of Final Fantasy on here? Do they talk about it? They don't. Um, I hate that. I have some notes on. on Wait, what? So it's interesting. The the wiki saying a Windows port of Ultimate Showdown titled Pipe Rebo was announced. The port adds support for visuals, rollback netcode, game balance changes. A version two balance update will also be issued to. To open showdown alongside Revo's release. I guess it's not really new information. But they're kind of bundling together the VF5 Opal Showdown with Revo. Who knows? Who knows? Who knows? Who knows? I remember Max described it as a breakfast of fighting games. It's so simple but necessary. That's a nice way to say it. Yeah. Your Wheaties. I mean, it's the it's 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 the grandfather of 3D fighters, like of 3D gaming, like of 3D character gaming. Like it's 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 that important of a game. Every other humanoid, three-dimensional, poly poly god poly polygon. Base character is built on the bones of Virtual Fighter. One, so it's it's, it's it's a super influential game, which is and like people like it, which is why it's sad to see them just screw it up by just doing nothing with it because they're so afraid because of the legacy. Like the legacy is what's been, like if, if Virtual Fighter wasn't so well renowned, I feel like we wouldn't be stuck having to have waited for so long for the new version to come out. Because they wouldn't be so terrified to make a new version. They're, they're, they're petrified. So I commend them for having the chutzpah to finally make a new version. Even if it isn't a full version. A new balance adjustment to the game. Even if it is just tweaking some, like, numbers. Like, that's really all they have to do. Because it's, it's a pretty good game. Just some numbers are jacked up. You know, some moves need to be more negative on block. Some moves, maybe animations could be 
better. Maybe? But I, I want them to be bold. Like, I don't want them to just make minor tweaks and adjust. I want them to really, like, really go for it. Show us what you want to do. Make this your training round for Virtual Fighter 6. And then continue to revise it. So they're going to, once you start balancing a game, there are going to be unintended changes, unintended bug fixes. Oh my god, I get to find bugs again! I get to find broken shit! I get to find broken stuff and bust it out in tournaments. Oh my god! I get to study and dig and out practice my competition. The, the race, the knowledge race gets to start again. <laughs> Give Taka, no Taka's getting, okay, 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 okay. Let's fix this right the F now. Right the hell now. We'll use this list here. Okay, even though it's not the most updated one, we have a there's, there's, there's a new a new a new tier list on Twitter somewhere. Um, but we'll use this one. This is in, fine. So Aoi, Eileen, Lei getting buffed. Pi, these characters, uh, El Blaze, Sarah, Lao. I don't think Lao's gonna get buffed that, that much. Might get adjusted. Jeffrey and Wolf, fine. Kage, it's fine. This adjustment, fine, fine. She might get adjusted. He might get nerfed. He might get nerfed. A uh, Go might get nerfed. Brad might get nerfed. Lion's definitely getting nerfed. Taka's getting his fucking belly. He's going on a diet. Okay, that man's gonna get nerfed as hell. Uh, Jackie and Akira are off both being nerfed. So, Jackie and Akira, top two characters, if they don't get nerfed, I'm telling you this right now, if they don't get nerfed, I'm going to riot. I'm going to actually riot. I'm going to say, screw this game, okay? I'm going back to Tekken. Screw this shit. Tekken, five more years, all right? Five more years of Tekken, all right? I swear to God, those characters don't get nerfed. Thanks for the community sub gift. The Woodsman, welcome back. <laughs> Rashi is honest fundamentals. Oh, Rashi is not uh, honest anything. That man in honesty should not be in the same goddamn motherfucking sentence. How could you type that? How could your fingers type those words together? How did it happen? What if they nerf? I need more. She's already at the bottom. <gasps> What do you think this is, Street Fighter? Tekken? It's a Street Fighter Tekken, okay? We don't we don't do that shit here, alright? We don't do that shit! It's not, it's not, it's not that game! It's not that game! That's how we roll. She won evils. She hasn't though. She hasn't! She won combo breaker. Which is still pretty good. This is VF. Our side steps actually work. <laughs> no, for real though, they do. <laughs> um, Virtual Fighter 5, Ultimate Showdown on PS4 or PS5 backward compatible is currently $8. 75% off. If you want to learn the game, now is the time. Two more fucking years. No, 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 no. No, 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 That's two years for them to cook. We want these bitch-ass motherfuckers to get in the kitchen and cook. Let them cook. Give them the time they need to cook it. Make a feast for us. The best, biggest, juiciest fucking meal you've ever fucking had in your goddamn life. You will eat this and you'll be like, holy fuck. 
This is so good. How can this be as good as it is? That's what you're going to feel like. That's what you're going to get. That's what they're cooking for you. That's what they're cooking for you. <laughs> and we'll get to find out soon. Because it's winter. We're going to get to try out their new version of the game. I can't fucking wait. I can't fucking wait. I can't fucking wait. I can't fucking wait. I can't wait. I need this. I actually need this. I need this in my life, chat. I need this so bad. You don't 